Um, okay, so I have to tell you guys about this. Um, I won't go into specifics or like details. I'm just going to get the, the main message across, the purpose of why I'm telling you guys this. So <clears throat> I just had reality throw me a temptation. I almost don't even want to call it a temptation. It's almost not the right word because let me ask you a question. Have you guys ever had a temptation thrown at you that was just so like such a would be huge temptation um and if you were in a different mindset um it it it's like such a big opportunity that like and the odds of it are so low it's like reality's breaking the fourth wall and it's like it's telling you look like it's like oh, come on that's like too obvious right right it's just too fucking obvious like come on like i'm not gonna fucking fall for that trick like there is no like the odds of this happening like it's like a temptation to fall into old bad habits and it's just like that fucking it's like so ridiculous it's just i started laughing it's just like it's fucking absurd there's no fucking way it's ridiculous um it's just insane man um like imagine if like an alcoholic who had quit drinking um just like on a day that they had just been like going so well going so strong for such a long time <laughs> and like some the mail accidentally sends him like just cases and cases of like the best liquor that they like the best of the best stuff <laughs> like the stuff that you have to be rich to even get like imagine if that would happen um like i like i feel like it would be something like that like this happens to like some alcoholic person who quit drinking and if they're really awake and in tune and aware they're just like like it would be one thing if they you know if it was more subtle like oh they accidentally received uh like someone offered him a drink to buy him a drink but like which would also be reality tempting them right it's reacting to him trying to quit and so it's like oh i'm gonna start but like like sometimes it's just so fucking obvious it's like is it is that on purpose is this on easy mode is it that the reality itself is trying to tell me like hey it's like one of those you know when they break the fourth wall in movies and comics and shit i feel like that's what that is it's the reality's equivalent of breaking the fourth wall it's just like all right if you don't see this one you're just a complete fucking moron um and we know you're going to see it because it's reality giving itself away like uh matt from quantum of conscience talks about reality giving itself away it's exactly what it is. And then, so, another thing that I guess I should maybe mention, because I, th I think about this a lot, and I've never heard anybody really say it this way, um, but, you know, reality implies real, because it's in the word, reality, it's real, that implies, or even not just implies, but denotes real. Um... <laughs> So, that being said, if you subscribe to the idea that, you know, we live in, like, opposite world or upside down world, or everything is the opposite of what we're told, then that would mean reality is the exact opposite of what's real. It's, like, actually fake. Um, and that, just thinking about that irony, just always cracks me up. Um, so, just mind-blowing. Um <laughs> Anyway, reality giving itself away. I don't know why it took me so long to um, get there. There's what uh, fucking Matt calling unconscious talks about all the time. But like he, I feel like he talks about it more with. I mean, no, he talks about it in like life situations too. But it also is in like you know the screen analysis stuff. Um, 
if you don't know what the fuck I'm talking about, I mean, I'd say start with listening to him, but I don't know. Anyway, guys, I guess it's already been five minutes. That's all I really had to say. Thanks for watching. Peace.